Country did this with Israel United in Christ on Captain Hoshia to my left. I got Officer Hockey. And look, y'all, today's topic gonna be seeing God. Seeing God. Now, you got a lot of people that say it's contradictions in the Bible. And this contradiction they say in Genesis 32 and 30 contradicts with John 1 and 18. And see, look, I'm gonna tell y'all this a lot of y'all don't understand the Bible. Get Psalm 111 to 10 real quick. A lot of y'all don't understand the Bible. That's why when you read the Bible and you see things that look like it could be a contradiction, you know what I'm saying? You be like, oh, I don't believe the Bible because this verse said that and that verse says this. Read. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 111, verse 10. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. A good understanding have all they that do his commandments. The scripture said a good understanding have all they that do his commandments. So some of the things you read in the Bible, you're not going to understand if you're not doing his commandments. So let's go and go to Genesis 32 and 30. Let's get straight into it. Seeing God. Read. The book of Genesis chapter 32 and verse 30. And Jacob called the name of the place Penuel. For I have seen God face to face. And my lips is preserved. Whoa. So right here in Genesis 32 and 30, uh, Jacob said, I seen God face to face. So now let's go to John 1 and 18. They said this scripture right here contradicts with John 1 and 18. This is the book of John, chapter 1, verse 18. Read. No man have seen God at any time. Whoa. <laughs> now look, if you ain't have no understanding on the Bible, what you would think? Right. You'll be like, hold on, man, this contradiction. <laughs> you know, hey, in Genesis 32 and 30, they say, hey, I have seen God face to face, and my life is preserved. And in John 1 and 18, they say, no man have seen God at any time. Now, let's get the understanding of that. First and foremost, let's go to Hosea 12, chapter 3. Hosea 12, chapter 3. And let's get the understanding of what Jacob seen. Read. This is the book of Hosea, chapter 3. In verse chapter, chapter 12, 12 and verse 3. Yes, sir. Okay. This is the book of Hosea, chapter 12 and verse 3. He took his brother by the hill in the womb, and by his strength he had power with God. Yea, he had power over the angel. You see that? He had power over the angel. That's what Jacob was wrestling with. So when he's saying he's seen God face to face, he was dealing with an angel. Read that again. Yea, he had power over the angel and prevailed. So that's who he was wrestling. That's who Jacob was wrestling. He was wrestling an angel, read. He wept and made supplications unto him. He found him in Bethel, and there he spake with us. So when he said he's seen God face to face, he was saying he's seen an angel face to face. And now look, this is what y'all don't understand, too. In biblical times, we call the God's Lord, and we call the God's angel. Let's get 2nd in to chapter 4, verse 1. Matter of fact, before we go there, go to 1 Corinthians 8, verse 5. Because Paul said to some about there is God's meaning and there is Lord's meaning. Check this out. Read. This is the book of 1 Corinthians, chapter 8, and verse 5. For don't there be, for don't there be that are called God. So he said, for don't there be that are called God's meaning. It's other things that are called God's. Read. Whether in heaven. Whether or in heaven. Read. Whether in heaven or in earth. So you got things that are called God in heaven, and you got things that are called God on earth. Read on. As there be God's many. He said be God's many. Read. And Lord's many. Then you know that what? God's and Lord's is only titles. When you go to uh, England, you know what I'm saying? These different countries, they be like, oh, well, this is Lord... Uh, Poskenbine or something like that, you know what I'm saying? Uh, this, you know, Sir Charles or this is uh, Master Such, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Now, look, let's go from there real quick. The second edge is four. So, Paul said this is Lord's many and it's God's many. Second edge is four and one. Now, look, remember, it said there'll be things that are in heaven called God and there are things in earth called God. Let's see one of the things that's in heaven. That's called Lord. Read what you got. This is the book of 2nd Ezra, chapter 4, and verse 1. Uh-huh. And the angel that was sent unto me, 
whose name was Uriel. So now this angel's name was Uriel, Reed. Gave me an answer and said, Thy heart have gone too far in this world. Uh-huh. And thinkest thou to comprehend the way of the Most High? So now this angel getting on Edges, you know what I'm saying? Because Edges was like asking a lot of deep questions, and he was trying to explain the ways of the Most, uh, comprehend the ways of the Most High, read. Then, then said I, Yea, my Lord. And he answered me and said, I am sent to show thee three ways, and to set forth three similar So now read the top of verse 3 again, read. Verse 3. Then said I, yea, my Lord. What did he call the angel? Read that again. Then said I, yea, my Lord. You see that he called the angel Lord. Lord is nothing but a title. Now jump over three chapter, second angel seven and one. Now I'm going to give you another example of him calling this same angel God. Read what you got. This is the book of second angel, chapter seven, verse one. Uh -huh. And when I had made an end of speaking these words, there was sent unto me, the angel which had been sent unto me the nights so before. Uh, so you see that? So this is the same angel, Uriel, that was sent to Edris. Read. And he said unto me, Up, Esdras, and hear these words that I come to tell thee. Read. And I said, Speak on, my God. Speak on, my God. He called the angel this time what? My, my God. God. Because when you look up the word, uh, when you look up the word God in Hebrew, it means Elohim, which means powers. Powers. Just like uh, Paul said, look, you got things that's in heaven called God. You got things that's in earth called God. But it's only one God, the Father, the creator of all things. This is only one son of God, and that's Jesus Christ. With that, y'all, hey, look, this country did this with Israel united in Christ. We pray and hope you got some understanding. Genesis 32 and 30 does not contradict John and one, I mean John 1 and 18. No man has never seen God at any time. With that, we're gonna say shalom. He used to scream black power while Haram was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission, minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold, from Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how we're men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof, I-U-I-C, we deliver the truth.